Last time on Total Drama Redemption Island, B is getting secret info from Bierdo. Joe formed an alliance with B in case they lose again. Tyler bonded with Ella, Wayne had the hots for Sammy, Justin manipulated Brick to vote for Eva, and in a shocking tie, Eva was the one who obtained immunity after beating Trent in a tiebreaker competition and right after Trent finally made up with Damien. Damien goes to Brick and begs him to let him be in the alliance with him, and Brick says that he isn't going to betray Damien even though he voted off Trent, he will stay true to what he said to him a few weeks ago. He tried to keep Trent in, but he failed, so he just hopes he's not immediately out of the alliance. Eva, Axel, and Bierdo are together before they start talking, and Eva says that Brick must have flipped on them, and Bierdo agrees, saying that that is the only solution here. Axel then says that they should act like they don't know what is happening until they have the chance to get rid of him or Damien. Bierdo says that they should get rid of Damien first, he's more intelligent than Brick. Justin comes back worse for wear until asking Brick if they're still cool, and Brick says sure, and Damien says that Trant was beaten in a tiebreaker. Justin in confessional says that this is what he meant when he said the vote was up in the air, he's just surprised Brick didn't flip back. Guess he's more loyal than he thought. Ella, Sammy, and Tyler are all enjoying each other's company, and Wayne comes over before asking if he can speak to Sammy, and Tyler says that there's no secrets here, he can talk to her with them. Wayne is a bit nervous before asking if Sammy would like to go on a date, and Sammy is shocked saying that that is a bit sudden, and Wayne agrees saying that he didn't know what he was expecting, he's sorry for making things awkward before walking away. Sammy says in confessional that she wasn't going to say no, she was just shocked he'd say it so soon. Raj asks why Wayne's so down, and Wayne says that it wasn't meant to be. Joe says that that's why they have to get rid of Tyler. He probably told Sammy that he wasn't any good, and Wayne says that's probably not it. He and Tyler had gone into a water drinking contest last night, and Tyler said he would love if he told her that, since she talked about him so much last night. Joe in confessional says that that plan to get rid of Tyler didn't work, but that's fine. She can get rid of some of his allies. B comes over, handing a list to Joe, and she looks it over before saying that this is a list of the current alliances and who voted for who on the agitated alligators. This will really help her when merge hits, and she will get B into the alliance. B gives a smug smirk in confessional. Joe in confessional says that B is nice to string along. He's pretty obedient. When the time comes, she will cut him loose, but for now, he's good to have. Chris welcomes them to their next challenge, and Ella notices that Trent is gone and immediately becomes saddened, asking if there's a chance that Trent is just late, and Chris says nope, Trent has been eliminated. Today's challenge is to face off against someone on the other team. If you are able to defeat them with your poll, your team scores a point. Since Ravenous Raccoons have an extra member, agitated alligators will have to elect someone to go twice. Eva says she will do it, and Chris tells him to put someone up blindly. They can't know who's facing who. Joe says she will go first since she doubts that they would think to put their strongest member up first, and Eva says the same thing, and when the round starts, they face off against each other, and after a tough battle, Joe is defeated. Next is B versus Damien, and though Damien throws some good hits, he can't budge B, who hits him one good time with the pole and he falls off the platform into the water. Tyler goes next and he is facing Brick, and they both beat each other till they are both wounded and they both knock each other into the water at the same time. Sammy goes against Justin, and Justin tells her to fall, since she couldn't possibly want to hurt his beautiful face, but Sammy musters her strength and hits Justin, telling him not to manipulate her anymore. Justin asks in confessional if it's just him, or did Sammy grow a backbone? He finds it kind of attractive. Ella goes against Bierdo, and she asks how Tran was voted off, and Bierdo says that Damien must have flipped, knock him into the water so his team will lose and they can get revenge. Ella obliges, knocking Bierdo into it. Wayne faces against Axel, and Axel asks if he would really hurt a girl, and he stops for a moment, which like it's Axel knock Wayne into the water. Finally, it's Raj versus Eva, and Raj is trying his best, but he can't fight against Eva's superior strength, and he's knocked into the water. Chris says that with that, agitated alligators win, and that also means that they can choose to send someone to Boney Island. Axel is about to say someone's name, but Bierda whispers into her ear, and Axel says that they will send B there. B gives a signal of appreciation before leaving. Chris then tells them he will see the ravenous raccoons at elimination. At elimination, Chris welcomes them before saying that the marshmallows indicate life. If they do not receive a marshmallow, they must walk the dark shame, board the boat of losers, and they can't come back. Now, Chef, tell them who the primary targets are. Joe, your strategy of going first didn't work out at all. Many people may want you gone since your losses were led by you. Joe says in confessional that that's whatever. Nobody would dare vote her off. Wayne, you were outsmarted by Axel. I'm not surprised, but I feel like I should point that out. Tyler, if you would have won for your team, you would have been up by four points beating the agitated alligators, but you just tied. Tyler says in confessional that that's better than losing at least. And Raj, 
You had the chance to win it all, but you blew it. And now time to see you safe. Wayne, Raj, Tyler, Sammy, you are all safe. And the final marshmallow goes to... Joe. Tyler is shocked, but Ella tells him not to fret. Now she can see Trent again. This is a happy moment for her. She thanks the team for being so welcoming before leaving. Sammy says in confessional that she would have voted Joe, but Ella asks to be voted out. She didn't tell Tyler that because he wouldn't have understood. She hopes that Ella has a good time with Trent. And that's that for episode 6 of Total Drama Redemption Island. What did you think? Question of the week. It's not Total Drama related, but how has 2024 been treating you so far? I'd love to hear your thoughts in the comments below, and I'll see you all next time on Total Drama Redemption Island.